Women's History Month means a lot on a lot of different levels. Academics, sports, military, things like that. It really just shows that we've always been there. Um, there weren't just five of amazing women doing things. We've been doing amazing things. The moms and the grandmas who, even if it was something little, you know, um, even if they were just telling their daughters, no, you can do that. That's important too. Or supporting, you know, what they do to raise the next generation, to support their spouse. Like, that's invaluable. And I think that needs to be recognized as well. I was the first woman in my family to join the military and the first person in my family to join the Air Force. And now I'm starting to see the younger women in my family are now making a career path into the military. I think my mom wanted to join the military, but her family was like, no, absolutely not. You know, so I think she kind of internalized some of that and was like, you know, didn't really limit us in terms of things like that. So I think being a woman of today and paving the way, it doesn't have to be I'm the first woman president. It could be I'm the first woman to set new goals in my family. And I think that's going to change the world and it'll change the world at least for my family. So I'm pretty proud of that. Representation matters. Like it is important to see somebody who looks like you, you know, accomplish something or be because it, it sends you the message like, hey, I can I can do that. I can be there. You know, at the end of the day, it's about being someone worth looking up to.